Okay, here we are in Visual Studio. Let's click on the Tools menu, and then we'll select uh, Extensions. And here we need to select on the Online option, so we can search for Base64. Once we do that, the extension Base64 Encoder Decoder will show up. Click on Download to download the extension. And as you're likely aware, you have to restart Visual Studio to get the extension to actually install. So let's go ahead and close out of Visual Studio. Okay, let's click Modify to install the extension. And once it's installed, we have to restart Visual Studio. And now if we click on the View menu and go to Other Windows, a new Base64 encoder decoder option will show up. We'll drag the tool window over and dock it at the bottom. That's just why I personally like to have it. Let's resize a little bit. Now we'll type in some simple text here on the left. And then we will click the encode button to base64 encode the text. You can see there it's base64 encoded. And if we click on the copy button here, it copies the text to the clipboard. We'll paste that back in so we have something to decode. And click on decode. And there you go. And I hope you enjoyed the extension. Thanks for watching. Thanks for watching.